think any time that there's competition, there's a higher level of accountability. So go back to what I was saying before, whether it's whether you're providing an online class or you are providing curriculum or textbooks, all of those can be uh, you know offered by for-profit companies. Uh, you, you, you better have the best product and the most cost-efficient product or you're not going to get the, the business from the local school district. That in and of itself is going to drive price down and it's going to it raise quality. It happens in every other part of our sector in our lives, right? In healthcare, those parts of healthcare where we've eliminated competition, we've seen price go up and quality go down. The parts of healthcare where we've seen we've increased competition, the cost has gone down and the quality has gone up. Public education is no different. And we've had areas of public education for many, many years where the private sector has been involved. And like I said, whether it's curriculum that's being offered by the private sector, textbook this, textbooks that are being offered by the private sector, or school buses, or fuel for those school buses that's been offered by the private sector, uh, that competition has driven down cost and increased, uh, increased um, quality. And that in and of itself, holds those providers to a higher level of accountability. If there's no competition for what you're offering, uh, for example, if there was only one textbook publisher in the whole country, mm -hmm. and that's the only place we could go for textbooks, the price would be high and the quality would be low because there was no competition. Uh, that's not the case. We have more than one provider of textbooks, we, uh, and, and because of that, the competition amongst those private for-profit companies has, has driven the price down and the quality up.